Hi, uh, good morning everyone. Today we are again going to look into another problem from Singapore Math. This problem uh, belongs to grade 6 and uh, the topic is whole numbers. It's considered a challenging math problem. So it's part of that series of challenging math problems. So let's straight uh, take a look at how we could um, solve this problem. First, Let's read out the problem first. Ahmed and Sadia were given some money each. We do not know how much money. If Ahmed spent $75 and Sadia spent $25 each day, Ahmed would still have $900 while Sadia, Sadia had spent all her money. What he says is, every day Ahmed spends $75 while every day Sadia spends $25. They keep on spending until a time when Sadia has run out of money. She doesn't have any more money, but Ahmed would still have $900. If Ahmed spent $25 and Sadia spent $75 each day, now Sadia is spending more than Ahmed. Ahmed would still have $2,100 while Sadia had spent all her money how much money was given to each of them. First, let's take the first important statement that we have here. If Ahmed spent $75 and Sadia spent $25 each day, Ahmed would still have $900 while Sadia had spent all her money. Now, you see here, they're going to, Ahmed is going to spend $75 every day for a specified number of days, but we do not know how many days. So, we are going to take a model approach whereby from this it is clear that Ahmed every day he is spending three times as much as Sadia. So, Ahmed spent thrice as much as Sadia. Let's record this in models. So, Sadia comes after as much as, so Sadia is your reference one box and Ahmed spent three times. So this is the amount of money Ahmed spent. He spent three times the amount of money that Sadia had spent. And yet, after Sadia had spent all her money, she doesn't have any more money, Ahmed still has $900 left. So this is the total amount of money Ahmed has. So after his spending, he is left with $900. Now let's go on. Now let's go on to the next part of the condition, which says that if Ahmed spent $25 and Sadia spent $75 each day, Ahmed would still have $2,100 while Sadia had spent all her money. So in this scenario, you see that the condition is reversed. Now Ahmed is spending $25 and Sadia spends $75. That is, Sadia spends three, three times or thrice as much as Ahmed. Or in other words, you can also say Ahmed spent one third of the amount spent by Sadia. So in either case, Sadia spent three times as much as Ahmed since we know that we don't want to change this. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to take Sadia the same. Sadia spent three times, right? And Ahmed spent one time, right? Now, if, the, if Sadia spent thrice as much as Ahmed every day, what happens? Sadia has spent all her money but Ahmed has $2,100 left. So from this, we can see that this is divided into three units. So this is of the same size as Sadia spent. The amount of money Sadia spent, right, is the total amount of money Sadia spent. So I can make this into three units as well. Similarly, I can bring that into here so that it is easier for us to compare units of the same sizes. Now you can see that this here from here to here is $2,100. That is, it's starting from here to here is 
and this is 900. So these many units, or 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 units, that is given by $2,100, that is total minus $900, which is equal to $1,200. So we have found out that this 8 units is equal to $1,200. Now let's record that 8 units here turns out to be $1,200. And 1 unit would be 1200 divided by 8, which is $150. So now we want to figure out how much money was given to each of them. Let's say Ahmed. Ahmed, we can either take this or this. The answer would still be the same. So for Ahmed, we take one unit plus $2,100. Right? So that's one unit plus $2,100, which is equal to $150 plus $2,100. And that's equal to $2,250. Now, for Sadia, Either we take this or this, it's the same. Sadia will have three units, so three times 150, which is $450. So Ahmed has $2,250, while Sadia has $450. You can also do a, a check on your answer. That is, for Ahmed, spend 75 every day while for Sadia spend 25 every day until all the 450 is used up all right and then for Ahmed check how much is left that should be equal to $900 and if you try the reverse it should be equal to $1,100 so that is a way to check uh, if your answer is correct I hope this was clear. If you have any questions again, as usual, drop in in the comment section and I will try to get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks guys for watching this video. Have a great day.